noses strike with their mouth closed for the most part, so they don't actually bite you. Hey. What are you doing? You're so scary. Yeah, a little tail rattle. Scary. Yeah, so scary. They think they're so fierce. But he leaves his mouth closed the whole time, so he's not actually biting. That's why it's a bluff strike. There it is. See, she didn't hang on. Just tag. She's trying to push me out of her cave. She's not as friendly as Janet, the dad, is. So, here we go. There we go. There's a good tag. This is Rex. Rex, come here. He is an American alligator. Good girl. Here you go. I'll give you the smaller pieces first. Okay, we do use her frisbee. Come here. Come on, Rex. Yeah, this is the food frisbee. Hi, sweetie. She does associate this frisbee with food. Aw, he loves head scratches from a breeder. Be two square feet. So you can put one or two in there and then any additional toad you add after that, I recommend so if you have three toads, you need three square feet, four toads, four square feet, and so on. But if you just want one, then I'd still stick with that minimum of a two square foot surface area. Below I have, go away Michelle, I'm not feeding you right now. The other one, go away Michelle, in their head markings. Oh, and there's one of the musk turtles. Hi Michelle.